Hey, this is Tony here with Salt Strong, and in this video, I want to show you a pretty cool encounter with a small group of redfish that I came upon. So let's take a look. Now there were a bunch of mullet right along the shoreline of this island right here, just cruising up and down, back and forth. Also saw a couple snook and some small redfish. And right up the point, right up there on the point of this island, that's where I saw some fish tailing and thought they were mullet, but they were actually redfish. I think those are mullet. Nope, those are reds. were right up against the mangroves tailing. I thought they were mullet. So as you can see, it's super important to be observant when you're on the water. Pay attention to detail. Get yourself a good pair of polar sunglasses so you can see what's going on out there on the water. Not just in the water, but on the surface. Because if you see that small little fin stick up, you're not sure what it is, make a cast. You never know. It could be the biggest fish of your life, or it could just be a school of mullet. But it's better to cast there if you don't know what's going on. Now this video clip was actually an insider report that I was doing and if you don't know what those are, it's part of our insider club where we actually go out on the water and you, we show you the trends. We show you what the fish are doing, what time of year, what tide, depending on the conditions that we're out in. And this will actually help you catch more fish in your area, whether you live in Texas, Louisiana, or up the Atlantic East Coast where there's redfish and trout. They're pretty much all the way from the very southern tip of Texas all the way up to Maryland. So you can find those fish anywhere and apply those trends to where you may live. So definitely check out our Salt Strong Insider Club at saltstrong.com forward slash insider. Until then, I'll see you on the next video.